All right, so you extend the warranty if you do a review. So I'm gonna do the review for my chair. I got the Secret Lab Titan Evo 2022 series, extra large. Uh, it's the hybrid leather. Um, so the hybrid leather, let me just start there because while we're talking about it, it warned that it might get like a little hot, but it would be cooler than the full leather, but it's not as good as the other material. I like it because it kind of has that leather feel if you like that leather feel, but it still feels a little pleathery, so it's not the full leather experience if you're super into that. Um, I definitely want to do this review because when I got this chair now, let me show you real quick. These arms are fully articulatable. You can push this button here and they'll twist, right? So when I did this on this handle, this little button that you push fell out. So I contacted them and immediately they sent me new handles for this thing. They totally covered it. There was no issue. So good on them. So I'm definitely going to give them five stars for how they deal with their program. Uh, the chair itself is adjustable on the sides here to get the uh, lumbar support, which I also appreciate. So again, five stars for including that one. Um, it's got the ability to really lie back if you're into that which is nice, so you can get any position you'd like on that. My one gripe, where I'm gonna say they uh, need to work on this game, is they have this magnetic pillow, which I thought was really cool. I wanted the magnetic pillow really bad. But often, when I lie back and start getting into my game, see how my head's pushing it down already? To find a good neck spot where I want it, sometimes when I get up, it will fall off. So if they made the magnet go down just a little bit more, that would be nice. There's my, see, right there. There's my four star for it. Um, other than that, the things you would expect in a high-end quality gaming office chair, right, are all there the way you would want them. Everything's adjustable. You can raise up and down. Obviously, it does that well. It's got a locking mechanism. Right now, I've got the ability to rock because I like doing that, being able to lean in when the game gets intense and chill when I have a moment. Works for me. So, uh, oh, I got the Lannister one as well because it was all they had in stock. I just wanted like a basic one, but the Lannister one wasn't far off. And though I'm not a huge Game of Thrones fan, it still has good colors. I like the colors of House Lannister. And my son was like, oh, it's like Gryffindor. I'm like, hey, I do like Gryffindor. So that's why we got the, uh, the Lannister chair. And here, I'll just show you the, see, he's got the cool thing on the back. And it's got the cool embroidery on the front, which all feels high quality. None of it feels uh, cheap or poorly made. The one thing I think is a little weird, going back to the parts that they could improve on, is they have these removable parts, which I assume is so that you can customize them or something like that. And I'm not really sure how I feel about that. It's, uh, I mean, it sounds like a good idea in theory, but I'm not sure how that's going to play out itself. See, and even adjust them in and out if you are prefer your armrest a little more in, a little more out, a little more forward, a little more back, a little more high, a little more low. See, it's got the full custom ability for whatever kind of person you like to feel comfy in. I did get the extra large one for weight reasons, like the normal chairs kind of cap at a bit of a low weight. And though I'm not like an incredibly heavy guy, the extra large chair went up to, uh, I want to say over 300 pounds. And the other chair stopped at like 210 or something it was it was it was not that high so I was I went ahead and defaulted to the higher chair because not all my friends are my weight you know and I want other people to be able to use my chair so yeah um at least they have that as an option at least they have that as an option um comfort wise for like sitting in all day it hits that um it's got you ever set on a, a firm mattress and it's not super cozy the whole time you sit in it but at the same time, you never get tired while you're lying in it or sitting in it because it's still supportive without being soft. That's kind of the, the feel of the chair. If you like a more soft sensation, maybe get another chair. But if you like that firm, supportive, you don't get fatigued sitting in it, but you don't get super comforted sitting in it. It's kind of that in-between. So, I mean, that's good because I use it a lot for work as well as, um, as, well as play and I like to stay focused, so I want that sort of feel in my chair. So that worked for me too. Um, that's about it. Uh, if you got a question for me, feel free to put that in the comments. Otherwise, you can get these at uh, Secret Lab. Yeah, secretlab.com. You should be able to find them there. And um, yeah, that's my, that's my two cents on it.